Hello everyone, I'm Crumbs and welcome back to Transocean, the shipping company. We have just loaded up for a trip with questionable uh, goods to Lisbon and then we will head on to Turkey and hopefully we'll make a nice 3 million profit that will make us buy our second vessel. So we will test off manually we want to save the money as 100,000 euros to use a tag is nothing we want to do so let's just speed up it's this port is quite easy to leave when you have this spot so we'll turn a little bit then we'll go straight full speed and then we will try and hit that marker between oh, hit the gap there don't want to hit the concrete barrier because then we are in trouble we have repaired our vessel it's 100% and we will always try and keep the condition of our ship our ships really high Because then your reputation will increase. Okay, is it a new record? No, it wasn't. Well, it was in second place there. So let's speed up. Let's go to ah uh, custom inspection, man. We have counterfeit goods there. Not good. Yeah, 65 containers of contraband. So we got 1.1 million in penalty. That is not good. Well. Sometimes you take risks, but it is what it is. Let's use the tug and we need to fuel up. Fuel price 371. Yeah, fuel price list is currently very affordable. Uh, we are a little late, I guess. So can we save this? No, we would probably get be delayed there. We can go to Port Said as well. So let's grab that and see if we can try and earn what we lost here. So we will have to go full speed ahead to don't. We will be late, but we'll just be one day. Let's use the manual cast off. And let's just speed speed out of the harbor. Yeah, sometimes you take risks, uh, it usually goes well. I think you will make one out of five, maybe even one out of ten. So in the long run, you will lose a little, little reputation, but you will make a profit eventually. So let's speed up here. Yeah, the deadline has passed, but we have an extraordinary uh condition of our ships use the tug to dock one day late but we still made a nine hundred thousand profit there. Uh, what's the cost of that 600 no we don't since we don't need to fuel up but we're gonna head to port said let's see if there is no nothing else to port said um, yeah, we, we will we will go to Port Said and then we decide what to do. So let's leave manually. Right. 14 million live in Port Said. Let's speed back here and I'm not sure how to turn around here. Uh, let's go out a little bit there and then we turn around. I think there is it looks like yeah it's over there so we can't turn around all that much let's slow down a little bit and wait to come around okay <laughs> He's running, it's like a race. 
And now he stops. Why did you stop? Crazy captain. He's probably drunk. Let's see if we can turn around. Without getting all that, we might get over it a little bit there. Oh, we actually will make it. So let's straighten it up. And we're off. So, have we visited all ports yet? Or do we have one? So, we're heading down to Port Said. Use the tug assistance, and let's see. To the port. Uh, we haven't been. Yeah, it's Stockholm and St. Petersburg that we want to go to. So. Let's see if we can find a nice contact here. St. Petersburg, we got one. And we're passing through Lisbon. Yeah, it's, it's okay, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. So, we, well, we need to fuel up, and I don't think we need to. The, let's go let's go that medium distance but we need fuel I'll fuel up Lisbon and then we go to St. Petersburg this manual cast off and we'll see how it goes so yeah we uh, we have been here before let's around let's go a little bit slower in the beginning here I think we will just back in there yeah we don't want to hit that but it looks bad, so let's stir it up a little bit, and then we do like that should be fine. And this looks like a good angle, so let's turn it around. We don't want to hit that one. This should be fine. There is an oncoming wrestler, but we should avoid that. And we're to yeah where were we Lisbon so speed up your shipping company has last lasted a whole six months I'm impressed a contractually agreed from now on my share is due every quarter 2.2 million 2.2 that's daylight robbery that's just the way it is the ships in your fleet are worth 5.2 million the capital you have generated is 9.8, altogether that makes 15 million and my share is 15%. Uh, that's nothing when you consider that I gave you the whole of your startup capital. I should demand even more, but hey, I'm not cutthroat businesswoman. <laughs> yes, you are. So, value your fleet plus capital pro data at the beginning of each quarter from today. That's all for now. These investor payouts are going to ruin us. I know... It's a little early to discuss this, but we should buy our investor out. It's going to take a few years before we're powerful enough to do that, but it will be worth it for sure. According to the contract, we can only buy the investor out once you have reached the rank of Tycoon. So it's quite a long bit to that. It's going to be quite some time until then, but the shipping company will finally be 100% ours. Er, I mean yours, of course. So... We are in 
in Lisbon. Let's use Tug. We did a half a million profit there. We're down to eight million. Let's see, how is 367? So it's really really affordable. Let's gas up. And then we have actually more things. So let's do this one. Let's do the ore to St. Petersburg. And 151 out of 180, that's pretty good. There is two things, I haven't gone through this. The, the capacity is 180 containers, but there's also a max weight. So in this case, there seems to be quite, well, not that heavy material. But if we are transporting, like say, metals, which is very heavy, then we might only be able to like have 100 containers until the max weight is reached. So there are these two in combination that we need to take a look at that sets how much we can take with us. So we, uh, yeah, we have to go with that kind of speed to make it because we will be there in 14 days. If we have been there in 17. If we do that, we'll be there in 18 days. So let's do that. Let's use the manual because this is the easiest port. Let's do full speed ahead and then head for St. Petersburg. And maybe after that trip, we will be able to buy the second vessel. We could take a loan, I know that. But I will try and make this without taking any loans. It might take another extra trips, but then we don't need to pay interest on all that. And we are fully loaded, which makes us take a little time out of the harbor. So, yeah, we are respected. Let's dock. We haven't been here, right? So let's use the manual and see if we can dock without hitting anything. So, I guess we're just going straight. A little bit. I see something. Yeah, there's a ship there. So I guess we need to keep to the right a little bit. And then I guess we have to wait until he is out of the way. Yeah, I'm getting a little close. I need to uh, straight this up. Let's do that. Now go back a little bit. And now we can try and go forward. And hopefully, he will move. Oh, that was close. Yeah, that stupid other ship ruined everything. So I have to try and turn around before we can hit that area. This one is a little risky as well. Usually we start from there, so... Uh, let's see if we can... Get this part here. Let's do a full turn. Slow down a little bit. should be pretty okay. And 
There we go. Yeah, it took some time, but I I, I don't blame my driving skills. <laughs> I blame the other ship to block that way. Is that enough? Yes, it was. Okay, 1.8 million. We now have 10.1. Let's see if we can buy... We can actually buy this one. It's 86%. Yeah, let's do that. We name it Crumbs 2. You will earn more respect if you fulfill company contracts. With a company contract, you enter into a time limited agreement with the company to ship their freight between two fixed ports. This means a long time contract for you. The trick here is to find lucrative additional contracts from the other company. Companies who can still make a good profit on all journeys. However, shipments for the contract with the company should always take priority. Otherwise, you will uh, incur a contractual penalty and your reputation will sink. One company contract should be enough to start with. You can see the company contracts in the menu to the bottom right. At the same time, you should keep a close eye on your capital. You are only liquid when you have 10 million in your account. Then the next rank is within your grasp. So, we are now down to 202,000. So let's have a look at the company contracts. So, we need to see how long the contract is and how much, how many containers we should move. So, Stockholm to Algiers is a quite long distance. And we haven't been to Stockholm yet. That one is quite short distance, but it's only two months. So I think the contract we will take should be a five months contract. And Felix Stowe Lisbon, this one should be okay. This one seems that's quite large, but it's only 900 there. And this one, well, it's quite far. Now, I, th I think we will try and hit this one. Or we can just wait a little bit. Let's let's uh, let's see. Let's we will try and get to Stockholm. So we have all everything. We have been to all ports. Um, we can, can we do anything else? No. Let's let's take these two. Mm, we will cast off and head to Stockholm. We uh, we don't have the money, so we have to do this manually. And then we will take our other ship and try. Let's see where we should do this. Uh, we need to take a contract there. Okay, this one is tricky. So I will go forward a little bit. I will make a little turn so the stern gets out a bit. And then we do a full reverse. So we get that one out as well. A little more. Because we need to. We can't get too close to that one. And then we have to go in there before we can head out. So let's do a little bit more of that. Yeah, we need we need at least a, a quite a distance there because we don't want want it. We don't want to hit the ground. We are down to 95 percent. So it's soon time to do some repairing. Yeah, we'll try and go down in the corner here as long as we can. And we swing it around. We don't want to get too close to that one either. But this feels like we are in a pretty good spot. We'll speed up and hopefully don't hit that one. I guess we need to slow down. Because he's driving really slowly. Now he seems to speed up a bit. So. There we go. Oh, 
and full speed ahead. That one has to have <laughs> he hit the nitro valve and just took off. But we're off to Stockholm. New contracts, deadline, and we also uh, we have this ship in Hamburg. So let's see if we can do. We have some nice con. We can actually see if we have the company contracts. So we have Stockholm, Hamburg, and it's four thousand. No, that is too much. We have two small vessels here. Uh, yeah, it's two and a half thousand. It will take forever to do. Now we will wait a little bit. I think this one could be decent though. Five months, Felix Stowe to Italy. Let, let's do this contract. It's worth 2.3. Are you sure you want to accept that? Yes, we will. Which means that we need to go to, uh, to England, but it's quite close. So let's see if we can, we can just take these stamps to get to the UK. And I guess we will use the manual because we don't have any money and we don't want to get on negative there. So let's speed up. Let's do a little little turn. We get some distance. And then now when we have two ships, we will make money more quickly and. Uh, we will use, well, I think we'll use the tug more and more, both when we uh, arrive and when we leave. Because it gets quite boring in the long run to do this manually. It's a really nice, nice thing to do sometimes, to just this a variety of gameplay. But sometimes when you've been to port 20 times, it's just boring to do the same thing all over and over again. Yeah, full speed ahead. This is the, the port of uh, Hamburg. This is really, really nice. I've been here, I've actually been here two times. First time I was visiting a friend. We were going to uh, Wacken Open Air. It's one of the largest metal festivals in the world. Uh, it was back in 2018, I think. And uh, then I spent a day here in Hamburg, just walking around in the harbor. There's plenty of museums, some nice beer gardens and all that. So I was walking around in a really hot summer day, having a pint of German beer and and we went off to the festival. So that was a really good day. So we are in port in Stockholm. So we'll do this manually. We, we could afford it though. But let's we haven't been in Stockholm. It look, looks a little bit cold. So it's snow and ice here. And we I guess yeah, it looks like we're gonna head in there. To the left side, so let's turn a bit. There is a ship coming in there. Quite fast, so let's slow down. And that looks actually like we are gonna hit the spot. Let's turn a little bit more. best time and we have money 
so we have the contract and so we get we'll get from uh, Gothenburg need to England so let's see if we can get a contract there Dublin is the closest one yeah I guess we have to take that let's go to Dublin we don't want to could we, we could do a dry run I don't like doing that let's see how if we take half our fuel Yeah, I think we, we need to, uh, yeah, I don't want to go past this. We, we need to start working on the contract. So let's, uh, let's go empty. It's quite far trip to go empty, but I will do it just because we need to get down there and start going. Okay, so that was quite close. So let's have to back up here and then we back down We're heading this way. Now we can turn around. There's a ship coming in there. We should be able to turn around pretty easily here. And we go full speed ahead. And we don't want to hit that one. Uh, uh, yeah, we're getting a little bit close actually, but I think we're fine. So this could be a new record. And I guess it is. Yeah, it's, it goes much quicker, accelerate more faster when you're empty, so that's probably it. So, both ships heading to England. Use the tug. And let's head down to Giratora. It's metal and it's quite heavy, as you can see. Uh, so let's see what... Do we have we have 107 that's quite a lot and then we can take nothing more so let's see if we can no not that one either we'll get yeah we can get these two you see that the weight we have plenty of space for containers but since they they are the weight of the containers is so heavy this is at the limit so let's grab that one we cast off we head to that and yeah, I, I will use this now just to speed things up. So, we'll use the tug to dock. Let's go in here. We need to refuel at 700. It's quite a lot, so let's fill it up to half. And then we'll see if it's cheaper to fill it up there. And then we go down and find the contracts for this. And can we... Sometimes you can get three. And look at that. That is almost full of all containers. And the weight is pretty darn close. So let's grab those three. Let's head down. Let's use the automatic. And that one was... Yeah, I haven't set up to speed. It's going too slow there. We need to speed things up. So we made a two million profit there. The ship is in decent condition. Let's see if we have a trip back to... We have a trip to Rodenham, which is close. And we can have Lisbon on the way. Yeah, I, th I think that's... It, it's not even half full, but it's some money back. And we just need to make... A pl well, uh, plenty of trips. 670... Can I see? No, it won't upgrade there. So let's do a 300 here and see if it's enough. Yeah. So Lisbon and Rotterdam, and then we just go over to Felix Star. Use the automatic tug there. Yeah, we definitely need to speed this. We can go to it now and speed it up. Let's see if I click it. We can just do that. Uh, but this one is in Lisbon. I'll use tug assistance. We also need to fuel up. 
We are heading to Rotterdam and there is nothing else. But since we are going to Felix though, let's load that up. Uh, we can add that right there. We don't use, we use the manual here because this is in Lisbon. And this port is, just go straight up. So we don't want to waste 100,000 on that. Then we can actually, when we left port, we can see how much we did the first run. Well, we wait until the second ship is in Italy. And then... Uh, so, let's speed up. Use tug. The dog. Go to the port, and then we can see how much we did. So we did 26% in the first two runs. So we need to do this trip four times. So we will just see if we can get back up there. Felix, though. Just uh, as long as we get paid for the fuel and we don't like lose too much money on there, I think we're fine. So I think that is a good speed. Since we have five months, otherwise we uh, will lose even more money. Uh, Rotterdam, use tug. We made a half million profit. Uh, no, we don't want to repair. What is the fuel price? 720. Hopefully it will be less in uh, in England. Felix, oh, 754. So what is it? Rotterdam. 720 it's a little bit cheaper here so I guess let's fuel up a little bit uh, here let's do like that I think that's enough to get us down to to Italy again but we are questionable do we want that no I, I skip that we don't want to get so contract to Italy. Uh, we can actually do that one. Something could we do? No, we can't. Otherwise, we have seventy-three. So we're gonna do seventy-three, fifty-nine, and thirty-eight. Look at that. Sometimes you need to try and just find the best thing to get as much as possible. But this one, that is friggin' awesome. It's just 80 tons below max. So, we're gonna do that. There is no time limit on these missions. But we need to refuel a little bit to get down there. So, let's refuel. I hope that is enough. Otherwise, we have to refuel a little bit more. No, that's fine. Use automatic. Go to port and fuel price 731. Let's fill up what just what we need. Let's find another metal contract here. That is quite that is almost full. So let's see if we can get a little bit more. We have this 70. No, it's not. No, I guess we will just have to go with the largest one then. The 70 plus 91 is not no. So let's go with 119, no, 135. Cast off, we go at that speed and go. Yeah, one month's time, they're gonna steal our money again. Tug assistant, we made 2.2 .2 million there. What's the fuel price? 650, I guess we take that. Can we go? Oh, we don't have anything good. We have medicine we can take to Lisbon, which is the same way. You just selected a contract for which your ship doesn't have the right permission for. So we could... I will, I will take this risk. It's 1.3 million to Lisbon. It's a short distance. And then we head straight to... 
Felix though. Tug assistant that went fine. Uh, England, perfect. Had two there. We, uh, yeah, we are in time. We'll be there in five days. Let's use the manual here because it's so easy. And I think this is a good place to make a cut. So, uh, we are heading up to England, we are continuing doing the contract and hopefully that contract will be done in a few trips and then we can finally open up the world map and uh, buy our first Panamax ship. So thank you very much for watching, see you next time, bye bye.